Hey everyone, it's Eric Morosco here with Performer Distinctive Marketing. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Um, as many of you know that I've been doing some um, more video blogs and decided uh, to move the venue back to my home, to my, one of my favorite places, the kitchen, where my espresso maker is located. Just uh, having my afternoon espresso here. As many of you know, I'm a big espresso junkie, so I thought, what better place to do it? Well, today what I'm going to do a little bit is I'm going to talk about um, I'm going to rant a little bit, if you will. Um, you know, one of the big things in business, uh, I feel, is being consistent with your clients. And some, some businesses that can really take a, take a lead from that, that really do that are a great example would be Apple. Every time you go to an Apple store, whether it be in New York or Indianapolis or Chicago, it's so much of experience. One of the kings of, of being consistent is probably McDonald's. Whether you go to McDonald's in Rome, Italy, or Paris, France, or Cancun, Mexico, Wherever you're at, the experience is, is, is pretty similar, pretty same. Um, so what I'm going to rant about today is actually uh, garbage cans. Yes, garbage cans. Uh, our city recently uh, gave us um, a can that uh, was automated. I guess the machine would come, pick it up, dump it into the truck, and they said we had to use a special can. And even though the can that I had was exactly the same can, just a little bit smaller scale, I had, had to use this can. And actually, I took the old can out once put it out there and I got a little note and said, hey, you can't use this can anymore, you have to use our cans. So what's happened over the last few months is that the consistency of my garbage removal has been shoddy at best. Essentially what happens is I take the can out there and some days they pick the can up and dump it in the dump it into the um, to the to the truck. Other days they reach in there and throw a couple a couple bags in. Other days they are, you know, they leave half the garbage in, half the garbage out. Whatever it is, it's never consistent. My idea is when I take my garbage can out to the curb, when I pick it up at the end of the day, there shouldn't be any garbage in it. Um, so that being said, it's never consistent. And when you, in my business, I try to be as consistent with my process with my customers as best I can. Sometimes it's hard, sometimes it's easy, but I strive to do that. And as we look at our businesses and what we do on a daily basis, being consistent with our customer service, with our process behind, our warehouse process, whatever it is, have that consistency that our clients see is important. So that's my rant, my garbage cans. I would hope that. Maybe my city would see this uh, video blog and it would tell their garbage crew to take the garbage out of the can. So until next time, it's Eric Morosco with Performance Thinking and Marketing. I'm going to enjoy my espresso. And my good friend Matt Walpy with Walpy Designs suggested that I call my little uh, audio or my video blog here uh, Coffee Talk. So if you have a better idea for, for what I should call it, leave a comment and let me know. Have a good one. Thanks.